Hello, welcome to the Met Office Week Ahead forecast. Following a cool start to August, one thing we'll all notice this week is it, it's going to start to feel a little more humid again. Humidity doesn't always mean hot sunshine, however. There will be a lot of cloud, some mistiness as well, and with that, Humidity comes the risk of thunderstorms in some areas. The humidity courtesy of an ex-hurricane, the remnants of which are now sweeping across the country. These red and orange hues showing a rise in humidity behind this warm front as we start the working week. The ex-hurricane still sat to the west of the UK, but right now it's no more than a typical area of low pressure. However, the combination of low pressure and high levels of humidity could lead to a thundery breakdown midweek. But we start off Tuesday with largely cloudy skies, some mistiness around hills and coasts of the south. The cloud lifting through the day and as the sun comes out, temperatures will rise up to possibly 27 Celsius in some of the sunnier spots in the south. But with higher temperatures comes the risk that we'll see thunderstorms develop across North Wales, Northern England, and later Tuesday, especially for Northern Ireland. Now, this is somewhere we're keeping a close eye on because there's the threat that thunderstorms become more prolonged as we go through Tuesday evening. Sub substantial rainfall coming from the sky for Northern Ireland and then through the night for Western Scotland. With that thundery rain, could be some localised impacts, so certainly something we are watching closely here at the Met Office. By the end of the night, it's across central and northern parts of Scotland that we'll see the wettest of the weather. And it will persist through much of Wednesday, eventually edging into the Northern Isles and the far north of Scotland. Brighter skies follow elsewhere, but further showers arrive into Northern Ireland and then eventually western parts of England and Wales. Temperature's not quite as warm on Wednesday because we are clearing the air behind this cold front. That will linger across the far north on Thursday, whilst low pressure remains in charge to the northwest of Britain. Further weather fronts bring in further spells of wet weather. And as we start off Thursday, it's Northern Ireland again that bears the brunt of that weather with uh, some heavy, uh, potentially thundery showers developing through Thursday. Those thundery showers potentially affecting central parts of England, Wales and southern Scotland as well. It's a breezy day. Temperatures are not feeling quite as warm either. Now, by Thursday night and into the start of Friday, we've still got low pressure in charge, but it is slowly filling. And at the moment, it looks likely that a system will work its way through central parts of Britain to bring further heavy thundery showers or longer spells of rain. Away from the showers, there will be some sunshine and it will actually start to feel a little bit warmer again. Southern parts of Britain perhaps seeing low to mid 20s. And as we end the week, we say goodbye to that occluded front and the low pressure associated with it. Big uncertainty as we begin the weekend. It is still a long way off, but at the moment, some of the computer models are suggesting that we'll see high pressure extending from the Atlantic, and that would suggest a fine start to the weekend. But note how there is low pressure up here. There's another low pressure down here. And when that happens, well, very uncertain, but it does mean that after a fine start, it could turn increasingly unsettled during Tuesday, Sunday and into bank holiday Monday. So that's something we'll keep you updated about here at the Met Office. You can find out more online and through social media.